Life is not always same. Sometimes it's like a beautiful morning sunshine and the other times it's like a dark scary night. And this is the reason at this particular moment when you are receiving this message your angels are scared for you. Because within the next 5 hours something huge is about to happen. You might have heard this many times that something scary, something very unusual, something very unappealing is about to happen with you. But nothing happened yet, right? But dear child of God, this should not be the reason for your careless behaviors. Because the devil is always working and it is God's protection and His love and mercy that you are still protected in this evil world. This is the reason God has issued another alert for His faithful children regarding the upcoming chaos. Not for everyone but for many worldwide. Although God has assured us that the month of July 2024 will be marked as the month where we will witness a pause in the demonic activities. But still, we are being called to be vigilant because many people are still going to get affected with a slight effect of such evil activities. But out of billion people in the world, God has chosen His faithful individuals to save them from this tragedy that is about to happen within the matter of hours. So don't choose to leave this video now or you will miss out on the protection God wants to provide you through His word today. I heard the Lord say, Dear child, I have assigned my angels to protect you from any harmful attack that is necessary to happen for the sake of righteous judgment. Always remember, when I am with you, no person or demon can harm you, not even the destiny. When events unfold in a way that seems contrary to your prayers, it can be painful. The disappointment and frustration may lead to questioning and at times anger towards me. It might seem like I have let you down, that I am indifferent to your genuine needs, yet there is something very crucial you may have overlooked. I perceive beyond the scope of your vision. If I withhold what you request, it's either because it's not what you truly need or I have a superior plan in store for you. Moreover, what you sought might have posed a risk to your well-being. Trust my children that I am safeguarding you from potential harm. My angels, your celestial protectors are in a state of high alert. They battle tirelessly against the forces of darkness that threaten your peace and harmony. These angels, my messengers, are a shield around you. They ward off dangers unseen and intercept the arrows of the wicked. But their strength is amplified by your faith, your prayers and your righteous living. I encourage you to pray regularly and have faith in me so that you may keep your strength and confidence 
within yourself. Pray as I have taught you in Matthew 6 verse 6 to 8. Where I have said, But when you pray, go into your room, close the door and pray to your father who is unseen. Then your father, who sees what is done in secret, will reward you. And when you pray, do not keep on babbling like pagans, for they think they will be heard because of their many words. Do not be like them, for your father knows what you need before you ask him. Also, my children, stay alert to the signs and messages I send you. I speak to you in various ways through dreams, visions, and the words of others. These are not mere coincidences. They are divine guidance to navigate the challenges ahead. Pay heed to these signs, for they are clues from me. Remember, my chosen people, you can never be defeated because you all possess one common quality and that is your unshakable faith in me. So keep your faith high and believe that I am protecting you from all the unseen and the seen dangers and the tragedy happening all around the world. Keep your faith high, stay blessed and never forget that I love you, said the Lord. Beloved children of God, share this message with at least 9 faithful individuals in your contact list if you truly love God and God will save you from all the tragedies happening in the world right now or in the future. Remember, there are moments in life when the sunshine fills our hearts with warmth and joy, and other times when the nights seem endless and foreboding. Yet, through all these seasons, there is a constant, unchanging truth. God is always with us. Even when we do not realize it, even when we cannot see it, his divine protection surrounds us. He is our shield, our refuge, and our ever-present help in times of trouble. God's presence in our lives is like the air we breathe. We may not always think about it, but it is essential for our very existence. Without His constant care, we would be overwhelmed by the forces of darkness that seek to harm us. There are countless dangers both seen and unseen that threaten our well-being every day. But thanks to God's unwavering protection, we are able to navigate life's challenges and continue on our journey of faith. Consider the many times when things seem to go wrong. When adversity struck unexpectedly and you found yourself in a place of fear and uncertainty, it is in these moments of trial that we often come to a profound realization that without God's protection, we cannot survive even for a minute. His presence is the only thing that stands between us and the chaos that lurks just beyond the wheel of our everyday lives. Reflect on the story of Daniel in the lion's den. Daniel was a faithful servant of God, yet he faced grave danger when he was thrown into a pit of hungry lions. It would have been easy for him to succumb to fear, to doubt God's protection. But Daniel trusted in the Lord. And God sent an angel to shut the mouth of the lions. 
This miraculous deliverance is a powerful reminder that God is always watching over his people, protecting them even in the direst of circumstances. There are many modern day lions den that we encounter. Situations that threaten to devour us with worry, despair, or harm. Whether it is a personal crisis, a health scare, financial difficulties, or emotional turmoil, these challenges can feel insurmountable. Yet, just as he did for Daniel, God intervenes in our lives, often in ways that we may not immediately recognize. His protection is not always about preventing every hardship. Sometimes, it is about sustaining us through the storm, giving us the strength and resilience to emerge stronger on the other side. However, it is also essential to remember that God's protection does not mean we will never face difficulties. Rather, it means that in the midst of these challenges, we are not alone. God walks with us, providing the grace and strength we need to endure. His protection is both a shield and a promise of His eternal presence in our lives. When we face trials, it is an opportunity to deepen our trust in Him and to witness His faithfulness firsthand. In the book of Isaiah, God speaks to his people with a comforting assurance where he says, When you pass through the waters, I will be with you. And when you pass through the rivers, they will not sweep over you. When you walk through the fire, you will not be burned. The flames will not set you ablaze. This verse is a powerful reminder that God's protection does not always remove the obstacles from our path, but it guarantees His presence and His powers to see us through. So if you truly believe in the mighty plans of God, then do join me in a powerful prayer right now. Heavenly Father, we come before you with hurts, full of gratitude and reverence, acknowledging your boundless love and unwavering protection. You are our refuge and our strength, an ever-present help in times of trouble. We thank you, Lord, for your constant presence in our lives, even when we do not always see it or feel it. Your protection surrounds us like a mighty fortress, shielding us from the forces of darkness that seek to harm us. Lord, we recognize that there are countless dangers, both seen and unseen, that threaten our well-being each day. Yet through your divine intervention, we are kept safe. We humbly ask for your forgiveness for the times we have taken your protection for granted. Open our eyes, Father, to the many ways you guard us and guide us, often without our realization. In moments of fear and uncertainty, remind us of your steadfast promises. You have assured us in Psalm chapter 91 verse 11 to 12 that you command your angels concerning us to guard us in all our ways. We thank you for these heavenly guardians who watch over us, lifting us up and preventing harm from befalling us. Father, there are times when adversity strikes, when we find ourselves in the midst of trials and tribulations, and it is in these moments that we come to a profound realization that, without your protection, we cannot survive even for a minute. Your grace sustains us, your strength upholds us, and your love envelops us. We ask that you fortify our faith, especially in the darkest of times. Help us to trust in your divine plan and to seek your face continually. 
Lord, we are mindful of the many times you have spared us from accidents, illnesses, and misfortunes. We know that these are not mere coincidences, but only the manifestations of your protective hands. We thank you for each moment of deliverance, for each instance of your grace that has kept us from harm. Father, we also ask for your continued protection over our lives, our families, and our communities. Surround us with your angels, guard us with your mighty powers, and lead us with your wisdom. Help us to live righteously, to walk in your ways, and to be ever mindful of your presence. Let our lives be a testament to your goodness and faithfulness always, and we pray this prayer in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen.